Hey y'all, I'm Sherry Dameron, and I want to tell you a little bit about the movie or the video that you are about to see. Throughout the video, you're going to see this book, and it's not there for just any old reason. This is my book. This has been with me throughout my life. It's got me through a lot of, a lot of hard times. This is a very hymn book, the old red back hymnal that mine's coming apart. But the thing is, is that I've carried this book with me wherever I went, even in all of my nasty and all of my everything that I did, this book was always there. It's like it was a constant reminder and it was one of those things that no matter where, what I was doing, uh, it just showed up and I could open it up and I'd say, oh, there it is. Let us have a little talk with Jesus. And I'd go on about my business and, and do my little thing and, and it seemed like I would be at my lowest point and God would just, all of a sudden, this would show up again. And I'm like, oh, there it is, at the cross, at the cross, where I first saw the light. It's like God was always reminding me and sending me reminders through this little bitty hymn book that, guess what? No matter how hard you run, no matter how far you go, I'm gonna chase after you. See, we think we're chasing God, but the truth of the matter is, God, is chasing us. I hope you enjoy the video and I hope that you are blessed by the things from this little book that have blessed me and got me through. This old church, it brings back so many memories. This hymn book. It's been with me through so many things. The stories it could tell. Some memories are good memories. Something happened, Mama. But not all memories Tonight, oh, are good memories. Down a country road. And I thought you should be the first to know that I'm not the same. And all those dreary days are over now. Those sleepless nights are past.
Now I see there was a purpose and nothing was wasted. Now I understand that his thoughts toward me, they are that of good, not of evil. Because he was intending to get me to an expected end. Done. I realized how worthless and how useless and how small I am in the sight of a big God. But then I keep reading in the scripture and I realize that what he said is that your thoughts towards me are that of good and not of evil to bring me to an expected end. I realize that he created me just to love me. He created you just to love you because he's that kind of God. And that's when I understand that I am undone, but because of his righteousness, he takes everything that I am not and he makes me in his image. Yet again, a whole new vessel. He didn't just put a band-aid over the broken vessel, y'all. He makes you a whole new vessel. What an amazing God. He is.